Well, Sampara State's Governor Bilo Matawale says the recent attacks on some communities in Bukuyum and Anka local government areas were carried out by fleeing bandits dislodged by troops. The governor insists the attacks will not deter his administration in its quest to address the insecurity. He stated this during a state broadcast on the recent attacks that claimed 58 lives. The gruesome carnage at Kofadaya of Bukum local government area where 36 innocent people were killed and in Anka local government where seven villages were attacked, four of the uh, villages were bombed and 22 people lost their lives. was a result of such movement by the bandit. Intelligence has confirmed that a notorious bandit operating in the Shankafe Axis was dislodged from his Shankafe enclave by a series of bombardment by Air Force. Nevertheless, the infamous bandit and his uh, gang decided to relocate to the area around Anka and Kukul, causing unprecedented mayhem and bloodbaths in that process. Many of their king defense have been taken out by recent military onslaughts. The current situation has left them with no option but to hang on whatever they call in order to survive. The current state of affairs obviously calls for the sustenance of the security operations and other measures we have put in place as well as the continuation of prayers of our gallant security to our gallant security forces in the state.